This game is T and is not suitable for kids. All right, next on our list, <laughs> we're going to go back to this old save. We are going to not try the spell out. Don't expect me to take your bait. I have no interest in such things in the first place. Who cares? It's not like anything's going to change, even if there is. Sinohara pulls Miyazawa into the conversation. Can I punch him just once, please? <laughs> Apparently we're not supposed to do the spell. Uh, we're not going to talk to her. Okay. Now at this point, we're going to say, do it. Oh yeah. Now we skip what the actual spell is. We're going to give it a try. I bend down to face the table. Then I make a jagged coin stand on top of another. Now it's time to slowly move my hands away. Even after I've completely taken my hands away, the coins are showing no sign of collapsing. Alright, I really did it. Alright, yeah, we skip all of this. It sounded more and more like a curse. The person who pops up right away in my mind is... Right, Furukawa. <laughs> Furukawa's dad. <laughs> what? The coins on the table collapsed. Why did it happen that time but not the previous time? Gah! Asshole! You made me think about Furukawa's dad! And I haven't even met him! <laughs> Are you serious? <laughs> you said something about removing the spell, right? Teach it to me right now. <laughs> I don't want to! <laughs> After school, I arrive at the deserted P.E. shed. Now that I think about it, just why on earth would Furukawa's dad appear at a place like this? It's impossible! Roll, 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 roll. Suddenly, the sounds of someone, some fiend rolling on the ground reach my ears. Hold up. A man I don't know is pointing a gun at me. This is too much of a surprise. My feet are cemented to the floor. That gun... Don't tell me it's the real fiend! Am I supposed to put my hands up in this scenario? Mm -hmm. The man lowers his sunglasses and glares at my face. <laughs> he puts away his gun. Then he turns around intending to leave the shed. But the closed door won't budge no matter how hard he tries to force it open. Yeah, <laughs> This is very weird. He looks back at me. May I? He quickly covers my mouth with his hand. What? Is he a gainster? So that gun he held was the real fiend after all. The gains must be having a war here. Wait a second, is this person really Furukawa's dad? Excuse me. I gather my courage to ask him. You must be Furukawa-san, right? What the heck? So he really is her dad. Gah! Thanks to that, he suspected me again! No, I'm just a civilian! <laughs> this would have been an amazing first meeting with Akio. Like, if you literally knew nothing about it, that would be freaking hilarious. <laughs> May I? <laughs> Does your daughter know of the things you've been doing? I can't see how this man could be related to Furukawa. For an instant, he really does look like a father. Yeah. 
あいつは知らねえよ。家族には内緒にしてる。お前も黙っていられ。わお。バレたら悲しむだろうからな。His family seems to be quite complicated. あいつさ、元気にやってるかな。はなぎさだよ。俺の娘だよ。Maybe he hasn't seen her for a long time. Perhaps he's just returning to this town by coincidence. Who knows? Tomorrow he may have to go off somewhere again. Well, of course there's no way a hitman could lead a peaceful life. That also explains Furukawa's introver introversion. She's always waiting for him, for a father who's constantly being chased after by someone. I can't even imagine how that feels. <laughs> again, this would be crazy if this was the first meeting with Akio you had. She's doing well, Furukawa san. I have to hold back my tears as I say that to him. This isn't like me at all. So, so it's a yoke. This is a surprisingly touching conversation. His smile brings me to the verge of tears again. If, if you have anything, huh? anything you want me to say to your daughter, I can deliver it to her. So, yeah. Don't worry, I believe she'll give her undivided attention to anything you have to say. So, come Nara, quotes tied to Miss Mayo. I stir. Tosama, eats Mosoba de Mitter Kano. His words are short, but I feel like I've been entrusted with an unimaginable amount of love. No matter how far away he is from her. He wants her to know that he'll always be watching and protecting her. I've certainly received your message. I'll do everything I can to deliver it to her. <laughs> this, that was a surprisingly super touching scene. Oh my gosh. This isn't. Isn't the door locked? <laughs> You're gonna blow it up? <laughs> he squats down and sticks something near the door. He then takes out a cigarette and lights it up, smokes once, then throws it in the direction of the door. Boom! What the heck is he? <laughs> he opens the door and runs out of the shed. In the midst of the ensuing chaos, I just stand still in silence thinking about Furukawa's old man. A daredevil and a doting parent at the same time. Her old man is just that insane. Please, please, please tell me we could actually talk to Nagisa about that. Yeah, it worked. Your condolences? You can't sum up everything with that this time. <sighs> you will never be able to understand what I've just experienced. Maybe I've just experienced love toward the man's way of life. Okay, if there's a follow-up conversation with Nagisa about this, I will show that. Otherwise, I'll see you guys in the next video. I'm late for school today. On the way to the classroom, a familiar face passes by me in the corridor. Ah, Furukawa! Yes, there's a follow-up! I quickly call out to her. She stops and smiles as she recognizes me. Yeah. What so I heard your family was pretty complicated. It makes me feel ashamed of myself. Hi? Anyway, I've been entrusted with a message for you. From your father. Here's what he said. My daughter, I love you. Remember that I'm always watching you from the shadows. Hi. Never forget those words. Do your best. Don't lose to any advers adversities that may come your way. Remember, I am always cheering for you. This was really touching. Oh my gosh. See ya. I tap her shoulder and walk away. It's the kind of morning that makes me feel like taking on a little more positive attitude in life. <laughs> So he doesn't actually get cleared up that he was just playing laser tag. Although Akio still had an explosive, so that was crazy. Wow! 